What's going on, Slot Car family? Welcome back to the channel and welcome back to another video. This is MP Slot Car, I'm Massimo, and today we're gonna pair these two American stock cars head to head. Some NASCAR action on the channel. We're gonna do like an MP Slot Car World Cup style head to head to see which one of these two reign supreme. So let's get to the track and get these cars staged and ready for their race. So I want to try a different format of running this tonight. In the MP Slot Car World Cup, I did basically a qualifying session between the two cars for each country, which I think worked great and you all seemed to enjoy it. But tonight I want to try something different. I want to run each car for six laps in a race setting on the Smart Race app. Then we'll compare the race time for each car, how long it took car A to finish and car B to finish and place them that way. Um, and also we'll compare the fastest lap and all that fun stuff. But yeah, I want to try this format and get your feedback on it. And if you like this one better than the qualifying kind of format that I did before, just moving forward on the channel so I know for when I run the next tournament that I'm trying to plan out on uh, the channel. So I'd like to get your feedback below what you think of this opposed to the old format. And yeah, let's get into some racing. All right, coming to you from the MP Slot Car Autodromo, we have these two great American cars here. The Dodge Charger 500 versus the Superbird. Which one of these two will be crowned the fastest car today? We're going to find out right now. I'm going to get this Carrera tire here. We're going to flip it to see which car goes first. Carrera logo will be the Superbird. No logo will be the Dodge Charger. Here we go. Let's flip this tire. And it looks like the Dodge Charger will be going first. And it's lights out and away we go. Off goes the Dodge Charger. Now we gotta keep the composure and not this lot in these six laps here. Lap one, pretty competitive. How's lap two looking purple in sector one? Sector two, purple once again, coming around to the line. It's another improvement, great lap time. Things are looking very good for the Dodge as always. Nice and planted, another improvement that lap. Three laps to go. Things are looking pretty good. Nice, neat and tidy so far. They don't improve on that lap. How's this lap going though? Sector one, not an improvement. Sector two, again, no improvement to the line. Not too bad. It's pretty, pretty consistent. Here we go for the final lap. Sector one and two, no purples. And sector three, no improvement again. So the Charger ended off with a 5.925 fastest lap and a race time of 37.582. Not too shabby, but what can the Superbird do to respond? Well, guess what? Lucky you, we're about to find out. Off go the lights and off goes the Superbird. Going around for lap one, things are looking pretty decent to the line. Pretty good lap time there to start things off. Going around for lap two, purple sector one. Purple in sector two, to the line, another improvement. How's lap three looking? They don't improve in sector one. Sector two, an improvement, purple to the line, not an improvement overall, but still a pretty good lap time. Things are looking pretty consistent for the Superbird so far. Another improvement that lap, lap four. How's lap five looking now? Coming around, it's final corner to the line. They don't improve on that lap. Lap, final lap, purple in sector one, purple in sector two, to the line. Oh, it kicks out on the last corner and they don't get the fastest lap on that final run. So the Superbird ends off with a 5.972 lap time and a race time of 37.100. Not too bad. And look how close these two cars were after six laps. Not even half a second difference between the two. And lap time wise, they're both very comparable. These are the fastest laps here that I've been able to do so far with them. And again, both very close. Wow, these two cars went toe to toe and they're both very similar on all aspects with race time and lap time. But the Dodge just fell short in the race compared to the Superbird. The Superbird completed the race in 37.100 seconds, completed the six laps opposed to the Dodge, which completed the six laps in 37.582. Not much in it, both very similar. The Superbird is a little bit more consistent. I find personally the Superbird a little bit easier to drive than the Dodge. I feel that it's a little bit more planted, if that's the right word to use. They're both very similar, but I just find that one for whatever reason, a little bit more consistent. I could drive it more consistently. The more I run it, the more I find that, at least to me, that's my opinion. You might think differently. If you do, let me know in the comments below. In terms of lap time, the Dodge was faster. 
it did a 5.925 opposed to the Superbirds 5.972 again not much in it very close and they both moved up a lot on the leaderboard I didn't beat their fastest laps they're both in the 5.8s and I think there's more to come with both these cars a little bit more tuning and I could get them I think into both into the top 20 which again is impressive I'm not a big fan like I've said of these cars I wouldn't necessarily go out and buy these cars as much as I've always liked the way they looked I'm always more into the GT cars and the F1 cars but having bought this Dodge a while back to have a stock car on the channel I'm glad I did because time and time again it's proven itself to be a worthy opponent and it's a fun car to drive and winning the Superbird on one not through uh, Sunday slot cars again was a blessing because I love this car it's one of my favorite cars now to drive and I think it looks cool looks like Iron Man I've said that so many times and that's its nickname on the channel Iron Man and it, yeah they're just they're both very comparable they're both great running mates for each other because they have the same chassis and yeah you saw for yourself the lap times are very very similar the race times were very similar both very fun cars to drive so let me know in the comments below what you thought of this head-to-head -head. and also let me know what you thought of this format if you like this better than the uh, qualifying style format that I've done in the past just so I know moving forward on the channel what you all like to see more so that's gonna end this video here and I hope you enjoyed it this has been MP Slot Car I'm Massimo keep your guide in the slots and I will catch you all in the next one take care ciao